right, so as you all know, it's now the first of the month, which means we have the report of how Nikkei did last month. And yes, it's not a great month. I called this in my last running report. Go and, go and quote me on it. I literally said it, and I got it exactly on the dot. On the dot, I said the number it would be, and I got it right. So I want to W in the comments for that one. But a lot of my comments said, no, go, go. Listen, buddy, it's the power of privity. You're underestimating the power of privity. And I knew just how much privity had, and it wasn't enough, boys. It wasn't enough, but... Uh, remember, it's not again bad. It's not doom posting. We'll make that clear because everybody wants to take this information and run with it like morons. Literally like morons. They just say, oh, no, the game's dead. 100% dead, dead, dead. And um, I don't know why. People have such a hate thing for this game. And also people that play this game have a hate thing for this game too. So it's like, damn, can't win in both aspects. But today I'm only sharing... Uh constructive criticism and how the game is doing right now that's all so remember i don't hate the game i love the game cool cool like and subscribe helps out a ton i always had to make that disclaimer because dude people run with information just and say you know what he's saying this 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 god let's hop into it so again this is the revenue report uh keep in mind i think this icon over here means like global and like everything is counting um so we're starting at the bottom here work our way up on this list and god bro some of the games that i've played are again on the bottom here in like shutdown territory which is very scary so first things first let me start at some of the games that i know of uh don maki battle chronicle such a sad thing bro game was actually really good uh brown does too not doing too hot this month peak of combat also not doing hot at all god um again i don't know man i really looked forward to this game and then i realized like before like, first, when I saw the trailer for it, I'm like, that's cool. I wanted to check the developer for it, and I just saw so much drama about the other version of the game, which is like a CN version. I automatically said, hell no. And I saw the launch. It was just miserable. Um, Snowbreak, still doing pretty decent. For whatever it is, Snowbreak does hold on. Uh, hasn't really dipped below a million yet. Um, this. So you, you've seen me pre uh, probably like say, like, dude, I wanted to play this game so bad. Um, my last game that I played from Crunchyroll got shut down. I was depressed, but I was like, you know what? They can mess up two times, can they? Well, they've messed up like 30 times. Let me be honest here, but I was hoping because One Punch Man World, One Punch Man being my favorite thing ever. Uh, season three got announced, by the way. Go check the trailer out. Amazing. Oh my God. Can't wait for that. But, um, dude, that is dog crap. I, I don't care what anybody says. 1.3 million on launch month with one, point, one, one Punch Man being the IP with flawless gameplay. It is disgusting. Everyone was fed up with the tactics. It was like... This, this is abysmal with, with Tatsumaki being the first banner too. Like, this game's shut down territory already. Remember that. 1.3 for the first month when all gacha games see about a 50 to 70% decline after the first month in revenue. For example, you'll see up here, uh, JJK was 22 million, correct? When it first launched. Now, even with the Gojo banner, Gojo banner I think it was like last month, uh, that was now only $7 million. So remember, it's, it's an insane drop-off. That's what that is, an insane drop-off. Um, so with One Punch Bad World, realize that it's gonna be down to like 100 to 200k that quickly, and it just launched. So remember that. And whatever it is to maintain the IP and everything, it's I, they're dead. They're dead. There's no way they're surviving. Uh, Tara Fantasy still holding on pretty well for whatever it is. Uh, they had the Evangelion collab starting soon, so we'll see how that holds on. Uh, Pokemon Masters EX still popping off. Uh, Tower Guard New World, the other game that I play, you may know of. Uh, it's pretty solid, right? It had the Seven Daily Sins collab. Um, I'm guessing. 2.2 million only though it's kind of crazy but um for the collaboration it was a great collab they helped a lot they gave a lot of freebies and uh for what it was two million that's pretty solid thought it was more than that though huh thought it was 2.3 i'll check again i don't know yeah i checked the uh, other site that said 2.3 um over here we have seven deletions going across 3.5 oh my god my game's dying <laughs> oh my god 5.1 4.1 black lord mobile okay uh, JJK Phantom Parade, 7 million. Still doing pretty good. Dude. Still doing pretty good. And damn, Nikkei got dropped that many places. Yep, 27 million to 10 million. I told it to you. It, Privity has power, but nobody cares, correct? What happens is this game has been doing some very weird stuff this year. Um, and I get it. I am not hating on anything, but you can agree. There's been a lot of banners where players are just wanting to skip. They don't give a damn. Like, what the hell? Uh, yes, there's waifus, waifus, waifus. Got it. Whales don't really care, bro. I'll be honest with you. I've seen it. I've talked to a lot of whales. They'll get one copy and move about their day. They don't need to, like, you know, C6 or whatever. It's, what is it in this game? Core? Uh, core the character or anything. MLB the character. They don't need this. They only want to um, just get the character to move on. And right now, it's like nothing's been so enticing for players. Yes, I get it. You know, like, the main the main gimmick Nikkei has, and this is a fact of the century, is Pilgrim Banners will outsell everything else, which is true. Most gotchas have that. Grand Cross is the same thing. Festivals will outsell everything. That's why there's so many festivals in the game. Uh, collabs will outsell everything. That's why there's so many collabs in the game. And Limited Banners kind of outsell. So, it's a lot of, it's like a gotcha thing, right? In this game, it's no different. In Standard Banners, nobody gives a damn. They don't give a damn. So, remember that. 
It's the three things that players look forward to this, uh, in this game, and it's in this order, is festivals slash pilgrims, correct? That's the number one, 100%. Everyone in the community can get hyped around those two, uh, the one thing, correct? Whether it be an anniversary, uh, just a pilgrim launch, that's what it is, okay? Second thing, collaborations. It's, it's a fact, 100%. I've seen more hype for collaborations than summer banners. I've seen more hype for collaborations than winter banners. So collaborations is on that list, 100%. And again, that is for a fact. The third thing being that um, limited banners, right? That's the third hype. So with those three things in order, it's gonna be revenue as such. With the fourth thing obviously being they don't give a damn, players really just don't care. It's like, yeah, standard banners exist, but it's like, first off, they've been making very mid-standard banners, right? Privity was mid as hell. It is true because you do need a lot of characters to make her work. It's it's the fact. So players that are just like wailing, they're like, ah, one copy of each, it's all good. Players who are free to plays aren't like, you know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna like, you know, grab privity. I'll just wishlist her because I got to wishlist Leona and Tove on the same thing. And I don't really run shotgun meta, so I don't really need her. So in most players, they didn't need it, right? Players that are truly playing solar raid and pushing things, they're gonna want her and they're going to wail. So they're gonna go for the uh, Tove copies, maybe if they could, um, or whatever, right? Or rather Leona, I'm trying to say, right? So that's where it stands. But again, it's 10 million, not a bad thing. You have to realize that. I know why people just keep like freaking out. I was expecting this. This was expected of the game, correct? It, you're just first off coming off a massive hump, right? Being you literally just got through uh, Modernia, screwing everyone. Um, was it Scarlet? Screwing everyone. It's gonna happen, correct? And like a gotcha skin and uh, I think like another standard skin or something like that. There was there was some good stuff, right? But I also saw this post over here kind of like saying some points that I liked and like one of the comments was actually kind of cooking, kind of cooking. So again, shout out to this person over here for like a pretty solid post here. Uh, but basically again, it, it's been slowing down. The entire point of the, the game, remember, um, is again, the thing is, I get it. Like this is a huge thing. It's something that I've been mentioning. They do take a while to incorporate a lot of elements of the game that we've been asking for. They also take a while to, um, like they say it in the past, I, I've shown this to you, the dev notes and like, over the course of five, six dev notes, we finally get it six dev notes later. It's just, this is how this game works, right? Um, for what it is, that's the Nikkei game. Yes, it's sad to be the case, but again, it's like my main focus is like, I have been asking for a like core content since day one. The real content we've been getting or like we get our Union Raid Solar Raid co-op. You know what I mean? Yeah, I get it. Overclock is wonderful, but it's like, Maybe update interception. It's been left for forever uh, since the launch of the game. It's been one and a half years of the game. Like, we can update that. We can update some cool things here. But it, it, content-wise, what happens is also players just, you know, they don't need to uh, incorporate, you know, the new waifus or whatever. They just get their old teams. And they're like, ah, I'm good. I can beat interception. I can just push story every two, three months. I'm good. So that's like one of the also kind of overlapping factors but this is again the main point that i kind of said some people are doom posting about it but again i don't think it's that serious the events in february don't have limited characters it didn't have it there was no incentive to whale that's true uh, again as much as privity is strong it's, it's not enough um this game is again like push that factor that you either summon for bunny duo a legion duo um what's the other one uh, is, uh missiles duo correct that's there those are the three things you either summon for a pilgrim or limited banners or collab banners nothing more nothing more there's no point to summon for a standard i'll wish this to her uh maybe if it's like a busted busted standard even then it's a to a degree most players will be like eh you know what i mean that's just how it is that's how this game has been designed um again plus look at the top of the uh entire revenue chart hsr was popping off so again i'd rather will there edit based on the uh most recent dev notes i think shift up has the right idea about changing the future but there's definitely a slow period in between events a lot of people have been saving it for the anticipation of a collab and again the 1.5 anniversary plus the recent skins were meh remember that so again with no collaboration i'm telling you now this month is going to be more abysmal this is probably going to be worse than last month um again yes last month popped off with what or this month basically february you know what i mean 10 million this month will be eight to uh, six to eight million 100 percent if only the character we're getting is again you know who right and one more standard hundred thousand percent of the game is not getting past 10 million remember why it made 10 million was first off because again yes privity was there um leona was partially there uh aid was there and whatever it is, uh, technically, technically this latest character, which is um, Eleg, was in there too, because she was like the last week, right? So whatever it is, I'm telling you this month is going to be 8 to, eight to 10 million, probably even 6 to 8 million. Because again, it's only the thing that players are looking forward to is anniversary. And with the anniversary scare right around the corner, players have already started to save. They're like very much hoarding currency. And then when it comes to... Um, what, what like we know of basically summer afterwards it's just gonna be low months until then uh the only like main thing players are looking forward to in my comments as i told you elysian limited collab uh pilgrim that's it so remember nick is gonna have those months don't do them post don't say the game is dead it's gonna be the case obviously we just can't, we can't compete with the top ones bro 85 million what the fudge 89 million damn 
Damn. Nick A. Who? Nick A. Who? Wow. All right. Well, with that being said, <laughs> I'll catch you in the next one. Have fun. Stay safe. Peace and enjoy. Damn. Nick A. lost the Summoner's War. Damn. Nick A. lost the Blue Archive. <laughs> I'm just kidding around. All right. Take care. Have fun. Peace out. That's been it for me. Take care, everyone.